I've had enough. <laughs> I'm so bored of editing these videos at the end of the day and being disappointed. Luckily, I've got the right person along with me for the day. Okay, Boosty, we're doing the ninja, ninja Cougs, yeah. to the Karate Monks, to the Pizza Cats, to the Ho Chi Minh's. Bang. It's a serious meme that you've set up here to bring 26 inch wheels. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. Oh! YouTube, rusty. you're rusty. It's been a week and a half since I rode. Last time was at Sun Peak. Oh yeah, I feel you. I was the same before my first day, but now this is day six. Where'd he go? I think he came this way. Oh, he didn't. Oh, oh he's there. Is it clearing up? Oh, it stopped raining. We might get lucky. My goggles are covered. Oh, yours are covered as well. Funny thing is, I didn't weigh my bike yet, but this rear wheel is pretty heavy. I think my whole bike is heavier with the smaller wheel. Because <laughs> those ones are carbon. <laughs> These ones are aluminum, but this one's like so heavy. Sick. Wait, no, let's do family cross. I want to try that gap. That's a big tip. Yo! No. Oh! That gap at the top was sick. Did you do it? No, I didn't do the top one. It's the one further down, and I came around. I was like, I don't think I have the speed, but then I just rolled off. I went boom. Oh, yeah. So I must have the speed. We'll just stop at all the major spots, I guess. Yeah. Which is a few of them. <laughs> Which is a few. <laughs> Yes. Yo. Ah, fuck. Oh, I can't do it today. Oh, shit. Oh, so close. I wimped out, but it feels fine. Yeah, like I just put no brakes into it and I like just cleared it. Yeah. I wasn't going like that fast. What did you do? Like, did you hit the brake? I just came around and went, ah, went beep. Yeah. And then just popped off. Let's do it. No, oh, come on. Whoa. Good to go. Oh, fuck. Oh. oh, if I just pull that. It's a big, for me, it's a big step up in commitment. Oh yeah. To go to pull up on that. I know like that step up before the drop, like I get that so nice. I'm just like, just do that on all of them. Oh, oh. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, wow. What in the world? You almost died. Yeah, normally this whole year. Go on the right. In on like the right. Yeah. It's not the greatest because sometimes it gets a bit sketchy. Cut on the right, and then just like slide down. But it catches you. Yeah, I still don't exit as fast as I'd like. Yeah. And then this time I was like, you know, I'm gonna try how I always used to do it. And I just did like the worst possible. <laughs> well, look at it now. It's actual blue skies. You're good to go. Schleyer? Yeah. How's your lens? How's my lens? Yours good. Okay, so is yours. Whoa, what? Oh, 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 I started getting slippy. Oh, I 
Jordan's crack gun. <laughs> I slipped. Did you? Well, I started sliding a little bit and went, oof, frick. Really? Dude, I hit my bottom racket twice. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty wet like, as well. You know, where it's like the drop where it's off joy ride to clear. Yeah. And there's like the drop. Yeah. I did it so sketchy because I didn't drop it, I rolled it. Because the thing is, when I drop it, on opening weekend, I popped my rear back tire. Yeah. And then on my enduro bike, I also like mangled it. And then the part, like lower down, where it gets to like that bigger rock face. Yeah. I never know how to do it very well. Yeah. I'm not very good at it. Ah. Oh my god, it's slippy. Oh, you are kidding me, Paul. Paul! I just, I decide I'm gonna do it, then I hit the rocks and then I quit. Oh yeah. Every time. What is wrong with you? Oh, I almost, I almost, it was there, it was there. No, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. Ah, oh, I just feel so much pressure about this stupid freaking drop. Like, what, are, what is your fear of it, I guess? Uh, casing the shit out of it and going over the bars and then not casing the shit and going boom. Yeah, like you can kind of overshoot a little easily. Like the last time I did go a little far. Oh, you are good. You are just being a freaking. Oh my god, it was almost it was almost there. It's there. Oh my, oh, 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 I've never felt so like, I just don't know what's gonna happen. Like, I know what's gonna happen. I've seen it a hundred times. And there's someone that's gonna go, oh, blah, 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 on the freaking keyboard. But I don't know, I can't explain being a pussy. Oh, I can't. this is, no. I'm so, I just can't take the f pressure of the whole thing. I'm literally shaking and can't. I, I'm just, I'm literally so anxious right now. Yeah. Like my hands are funny. Like my heart rate is insane. <sighs> oh my god! Oh, that's getting insane. Ah, oh, I'm still feeling funny. Yeah. Yeah. Oh! Yo. Ooh. Oh! Oh. The blue skies and sunshine over there 
and then miserable and raining over here. Well, the lift, where's the entrance? Well, I know, it's all closed up. Oh no, they're closing it, look. I mean, that's probably not the worst if it's three degrees at the yeah, top. I I've kind of lost the mood. I was I was just like, I put so much pressure on myself all morning. Like yeah. it was, I was sat, and then it all kind of got pretty gnarly when I was doing, uh, when I was rolling into clown shoes. Maybe just try and have fun mountain biking. I, I don't know what that's like. <laughs> so why are you going back to 740 mil bars, Jordan? This is an exclusive uh, gotcha interview. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's just for my enduro bike because then I can do X ups. Okay. Easier. There I we go. I technically can do them with my 780 mil bars right now, but I'm a little bit afraid that being too wide, they can get caught and stuff and just be a bit too awkward. Yeah. So I'm going down to 745 just to keep it simple, keep it easier. Um, I want to do X ups again. There you go. So I'm not looking for any sympathy. I'm not giving any excuses. And b by the way, this is me and Jordan getting our thumbnails for the videos that we've had today. I was just a wimp. I didn't do it. And that's the long and the short of it. All week, I've just wanted to do that one stupid thing and then go and do fade to black and whatever. But I knew I had to go and do this one first before I let myself. And the same with that ski jump. It's the lip is super chill, but I've had this problem for years. I just get in my head and I can't do it. Everyone's in the comments and some people are writing some pretty hurtful things, but really I agree with them. Like, that's it. I'm just being a wimp and I'm not doing it because I'm too scared. And the thing is, there's no actual solution. The solution is to just do it. And I know that, but that's just it. I have an amazing life now with a job. I get paid to do this. A lot of people like comment, why is this person sponsored? And after all the disappointment of the day, uh, we actually bumped into this dude, Chris, and he told us this. Hey, buddy. Nice wrong. Oh, yeah. I'm on a trip up here from LA. From where? Been, yeah, from, I drove here from LA. I've been oh, using, nice. I've been using a bunch of your, your videos, like your guide videos. Oh, so that's thanks. awesome. Thanks, man. I hit uh, a bunch of the stuff that you recommend, so oh. appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you so much. That means everything. Yeah, oh, yeah. Cheers, dude. What are you doing now? Attempting to work my way up a I've been riding here for 15 years, and I still can't hit all of it, so. Well, Welcome to the club, my friend. I've literally been here all week making videos and having people comment about how bad I am at A-Line. <laughs> Every day. Whatever, man. Do you want to follow us? Maybe it'll help a little bit. Sure, hell yeah, that'd be awesome. I, it's no mystery, I'm not the best person at riding a bike in the world. <laughs> I don't think I've ever said that. I mean, my channel is literally called Paul the Punter for a reason. Like, I just want to get better at man biking. And I work with a bunch of brands, and that's why, because I, can create videos and content and I and I have an audience that wants to know what I do and that's why I work with them. I, I don't know why people keep saying this in the comments. It's not like I'm going around like, oh, I'm amazing at riding, oh, yeah, yeah. And really, my biggest critic is myself and I put a lot of pressure on myself for a lot of things and this is one of them. So you're actually seeing, this is just how it is. Like, when I come in back and I explain what happened, People kind of come at me and say that it's making excuses. And you know what, it probably is. But that that really is just, I'm just saying what happened. Today there was really no other reason or excuse or whatever, I just didn't do it. Because I was scared. So there you go, that's why. And I built myself up into a right state and it, <laughs> it got tough and it shouldn't be. I'm supposed to have this amazing job where I go and man bike and I make videos and that's that's actually what I do now. So yeah, so that's why I just kind of gave up and I was just like, I'm just gonna go and ride the bike. Tomorrow is actually pretty cool. I'm going to speak at a tourism so symposium, convention, one of them. And there's a couple of other people, one of them you really do know. So tomorrow I'm gonna do like the smallest bit of riding in the morning and then I'm gonna take you through to me on a panel discussion. Wow, this really is just ripping off case by step. Okay, cheers punters. I'll see you tomorrow, I guess.